all right my people welcome back on to this channel well this is another strong one reaching us niger republic shuns tinumbo's gesture denies nigerians entry despite reopening of border all right my people this is another strong one reaching us well this after the reopening of the nigerian niger republic land and then air borders by the federal government of nigeria nigerians authority have not said anything even as they maintained their entry point closed well nigeria nigeria announced the reopening of its borders with niger republic on march 13 2024 while security operatives like the Nigeria Custom Service NCS and the Nigeria Immigration Service NIS have uh, eased movement along border communities. Their counterparts across the borders have remained adamant. This is as residents of border communities, especially on the nigerian side on thursday expressed optimism that with the directive of president bola ahmed tinumbu to reopen the borders with niger republic life would be easier for them and then their neighbors especially in terms of trading president tinumbu's directive was in line with the decision of the economic community of West African states, ECOWAS, Authority of Heads of State, and then government at its extra extraordinary summit on February 24, 2024, in Abuja. The Controller General of Immigration, CGI, Kemi Nandap, had in a follow up to what Tinumbu said directed that restrictions on movement are at nigeria nigeria niger border be lifted nandab gave the directive through a statement signed by the acting service public relations officer mr kenneth kure on thursday in abuja the, she directed all controller stationed at stated at state and um, borders command along the nigeria niger republic border to comply promptly and uh, lift all restrictions on human movement the border closure was part of sanctions to restore democratic order after the military intervention in niger that ousted president mohammed bazum the two countries heavily relied on each other for economic and then social activities, among others. The Niger-Nigeria border in uh, 1,608 kilometers stretching from Sokoto through Kebi, Kasina, Jigawa, Yobe and the Bono State. After the reopening of the land borders, our uh, correspondent in the affected state monitored the situation around the boundary areas. Their investigations revealed that on the Nigerian side, the borders have been reopened in majority of the areas, but it is a different story on the Nigerian side. Resident who spoke with our correspondent said if the two neighboring countries reached a common ground, it would be mutually beneficial as it would revive economic activities in the border communities. Long way to go in Casina. Well, in Casina State, resident of the border town of Kongolam, which is less than 20 kilometers from Dara, said security forces on the Niger Republic side blocked their own path. Lawan, secretary who spoke to our correspondent, said shortly after we spoke with you about the border reopening on the Nigerian side, the on the Nigerian side, the Nigerian the Nigerian police brought three of their operational vehicles and then blocked the pathway using stones and then sand 
they told our people who were about to cross that they should go back as the border had not been reopened on their side he said secretary who said he was not happy with the development added that whatever the situation was there was the need for outstanding between nigeria and the niger just remember that it is not only about business transactions we have marital ties with the people of niger also remember that our people have been importing and exporting certain commodities with extreme difficulty through illegal entry point spending a lot of money to find their way that alone has helped in raising the cost of commodities because whatever you spent along the way must be reflected in the selling price he said he said the items mostly traded across the borders in their houses included date soaps and then other confectionery products as well as grains and then cattle he added that with the high rate of foreign exchange with regard to the cfa cattle had become more expensive he however expressed confidence that if there would be mutual understanding between the nigerian and then the nigerian authorities there would be gradual return of trading activities and then hopefully the exchange rate of the cfa would come to an end at Gibia town also in a casino state residents were in a joyous mood saying their lifeline would soon be restored al mustafa Dai said many people were forced out of business as they had eaten up their capital but with the latest development there was hope for a new life our market used to be frequented by traders from neighboring communities from niger republic on our part we used to import farm produce such as tiger nut dates and then beans we also have other commodities that pass through niger on transit from kutonu we believe that if normalcy returns prices of these commodities would crash and then life would be easier for us he said ada lamana a trader and then resident of magama in Gibia, said the border there had been opened by both customs and then immigration officers on the nigerian side he expressed optimism that prices of all commodities would fall and then life would become easier for the people of the area and the country in general when contacted the spokesman of the nigeria custom service casino area command ty balarabi said the border in Gibia was reopened following the president's directive niger border at uh, megatari still closed Onto this, our correspondent reports that the Megatari border in Jigawa State was reopened on Thursday at exactly 6 a.m. According to him, ranking security officials in charge of the area. However, the Niger Republic security operatives have kept their closed. They have refused to open theirs, but they are not asking anybody not to cross over into their land by foot. All items that are legally allowed will now be transported through the border following the right channels, but items that are banned remain banned. Things like beans, if you pay duty, you won't be allowed to bring it into Nigeria. One of the officials 
who did not want his name mentioned because he was not authorized to speak said on their part residents of megatari and the environs have expressed hope that once the borders on both sides are fully opened the development would yield positive result speaking on behalf of the community the representative of the district head of megatari yakubu amino wakili said we thank god that the border has been opened and then as directed by the federal government of nigeria all seized items have been returned to us all right and then this is exactly what is reaching us right now well according to what a lot of people are saying hmm, ogatinubu should be very very careful it is obvious that these people might be working with northern nigeria elders to deliver a sinister agenda with wisdom is profitable yes yeah, so mm, well according to according to ajayi he made it clear that tinumbu thinks say he gets sense abi well it is not the border closure that is the problem it is the strength of the naira according to the exchange rate a bag of foreign rice at niger is about seventy three thousand naira how much will you sell after transport and the payment of duties they will just come in with their little cfa and then buy off the remaining food we are managing all right that's another strong one well my brother my sister a lot of people have actually reacted in different forms on to this what more can we say my people meanwhile let me have your own take on this one and remember to subscribe for more updates if you are just joining us on this channel for the first time all right thanks and god bless